scored 13 from 15 penalties in the tournament. Faces Perez. And scores. It's his second goal, first penalty, round the body of the keeper, between arm and leg. Agüinagalde, Dulcebaev puts it back to the centre, Canielas wants to get some pace going, Grabarchi. Hoping to get the attacking foul. Duchebaev dummies the shot, passes to Rivera. Ah, oh, dainty lob, but it goes wide of the post. He had a big angle. It's the right thing to do. Poorly executed. So again, Krajewski comes around from the wing, gets a shot from Moros as he goes. Another free throw, Jurkiewicz, Sipsak putting a block on, on the line and uh, Entre Rios and Guardiola just get a glaring look from Martin Gierding. Defenders are blocking, Moros and Guardiola in the middle. And working like Trojans. It's Guardiola who got it in fact. Shot efficiency plummeting for Poland, 44%, 54% for Spain. Rivera's come around on the line. Maqueda finds Aguinagalde, tries to release it to Rivera. Stolen by Grabarczyk, but unfairly say the referees. Entre Rios. Maqueda, nice little handoff. Stutters a bit. Thomas looking for play by Papkowski getting in the way. 26 year old who plays for Kielce. And, uh, meanwhile, Grabarczyk who went down on that last one. For the last five minutes of the game, Spain with a two-goal lead. Little handoff, Mikhail Jurecki blocked, oh, and it comes off the floor. Unlucky, did well to get in the way. Oh, lovely look. Seba having a good day here. He'd scored six goals in the tournament. He'd only played an hour and a half in the tournament coming into this game. Today, he scored as many goals in this match as he has in the whole tournament. One goal, the deficit. Goals without reply by Poland. They're getting back into this now. Straight through. And that brings to an end the run of six minutes without a goal. And Rios scoring. It scores a two goal lead. And we've had a table official Just blow the whistle, calling uh, Martin getting over the referee. Uh, Matt Sanson, rather. And it's a full So, oh. shame. Just getting a little bit of a head of steam going, and not only the two minute suspension, but possession goes over it as well for that uh, mistake by Shiba. Just a little too anxious to get on. So, the initiative handed back to Spain as Shiba moves down the line to sit down. Rabarczyk on the bench, not unduly impressed. Given a break from defensive duties. Maqueda, two on the line. 
Makeda again. Into the wing. A little bit too high for Thomas to do much about that. Makeda comes in. Has to go through Canielas. Last ditch defending by the Poles on the line. Team timeout, Spain. Cadenas keen to make sure that they uh, make good use of this power play as we get into the closing stages. Now, these images show you so much that you uh, you miss in the course of the match normally. So play resumes, passive play. Thomas maybe should have taken over too many steps anyway, he's given possession back. Jurkiewicz takes it. Well inside the last three minutes and a two-goal deficit for the Poles and uh, Hapkowski on the bench is putting on the goalkeeper's bib, but Schmal has come off. They're taking forever to do it. A bit of early planning would be good. Finally, Hapkowski comes on with the green top. Oh, well, Grabarczyk nearly went on the bench that's one back Krajewski it's first of the game and they're counting the numbers carefully into the last two minutes one goal in it if this finishes level it goes to extra time it'll be two times five minutes Just to turn, penalty. Canilla spins around, his arm taken as he went to shoot, and Bigler there. But uh, Nikal Jurecki gave him a little bit of a push, and Jurkovic has been so good in defense. Just got spun around, he got there too late. The responsibility to give what could be. A crucial two goal lead falls on Valero Rivera, the 29 year old who plays in France. For Nantes, Schmal. Oh, he scores! He'll be short-handed for a few more seconds. No need to uh, put the goalkeeper's big on uh, on Khabkowski. They are back to full strength. One and a half minutes remaining. Mikhail Jurecki comes around. Oh, that's good. That's one. Sheba, goal number seven for him. Dinyas demonstrates with the defence on this occasion. Found wanting. Daniela's closing the door too late. Into the last minute. Both sets of fans are on their feet, cheering on their teams. Mistake here. Poland could hit them on the break, take it to extra time. And that's Hansen comes in, seeing a lot of pushing and shoving. Six of one, half dozen of the other, gives a warning to both teams. And steps back again. 43 seconds. Panielas will be looking to try and get a free throw if they can. Makeda goes down. Perfect. Clock keeps going well, the referee stops it. Didn't really do anything wrong. He was behind Sheba. Caught his arm. 31 seconds. Passive play is being worn now. Need a shot. 
Jamal puts it up, 20 seconds for Poland to snatch the draw, take the match to extra time, a huge draw, even the fans are supporting the Poles, have taken the keeper out, Mikhail Uretsk is in, 5-2 attack, seconds to go, they have, Shipshak, all square, was it, Shiba in fact, Incredible scenes. Bigla, breathless. Cadenas, disappointed. It'll go to extra time. Here it is again, through the gap, and just on the inside post to beat Perez. Set up by Mikhail Juretsky, scored by Mikhail Sheba. His eighth goal. And most important one. So there'll be a five minute break as we see this one again. Underneath the keeper. Well, 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 there were two goals down without much time remaining. 24 all then, it'll go to extra time. So the teams rallied around the coach, let you listen in.